Yo, sup everyone, we're back at Tales of Arise. Time for us to finally enter this Dane Tower and see what lies ahead. Stairs. Or, Which way do we go? Oh. I say up. I sense presence is below us, but not as large. Uh, you know, you say up, which makes me want to go down. I'm sorry, but that's just how it be sometimes, you know? You can tell me to go one way, but that doesn't mean I'm going to. A soaring tower near Mount Diara. There's something down here, and I want to know what it is. I don't care if it's a, a less noticeable presence. I'm curious. I'm curious, darn it, and I want to know what it be. There's clearly some stuff down. Oh. Aha! I forgot to look before I leaped. Laws. <laughs> he, he just broke his legs into multiple pieces. He went from being single jointed to probably like triple jointed in his legs. Who knows? Maybe that'll maybe that'll be a good way of learning to fight. I don't know. Oh God. I have a you know Bad feeling about this. Yeah, I do too. Let's flee. <laughs> to survive. Okay. I, I wonder... Wow, it just despawns the enemies. Okay. <laughs> I love how he opens that. Oh, man. I'm... This game is really... Like, that level 66 enemies, and I'm not even... Look at us. We're, we're 35 and 36, man. What is with the sudden insane difficulty spike? I feel like I should be continuing with the main plot, because... I don't know. I'll try... I mean, I'm gonna try heading upwards. But I'm probably only going to head to the to the place at the top. I'm probably not going to enter it. Because considering what was down below, and they said there's a stronger presence up above, I'm going to take a wild guess and go out on a limb here and say that chances are it's probably not going to be a fun time. So we're going to head up here, see what it looks like at least, for the sake of prettiness. It's just steps upon steps. Why would someone build this? Flashbacks to Shinra Mark, HQ. Right? It would take someone real kooky to build all this. Right. Right. And before it's like her family or something, and then he's like, oh shit. Oh, I did another bad thing. Oh crap. Law has a great, has a great uncanny ability to do that. Where he says some random ass stuff and he's just like, huh. You'd have to be a pretty big dumbass to make something like this, and then it ends up just being something related to Rinwell. And he goes like, "Ah, oh, shit." It's so thick here. Even we can sense yeah, it. Get thick. ready, everybody. I we... was born ready. Nothing can surprise me. He's then gonna get surprised. Watch. Oh wait. Oh god. I was. Uh oh. Uh oh. What what do you mean? Look up there! Oh the my there? fucking god, Please what is that? We don't have to fight that. We'll worry about that later. There are things on the ground to deal with first. Okay, okay, I got thrown to a boss fight suddenly. Uh shit, I'm not gonna be able to fight this. I've got this. Let a marksman Bro. All yours. This music is I feel like I'm fighting a Dark Souls boss. Kind of fitting considering Elden Ring just came out a few days ago. Oh god, bro. What the fuck am I supposed to do about this? I'm... I'm definitely gonna have to reload a save and just kind of exist. We'll get right back to the side quest soon here. Oh my god! What the fuck was that thing? Oh wait, did it just kill all of these things? Wow. Okay, well, I appreciate that. We kind of killed all of those things, so thanks, I guess? This one's all mine. Gee, I'm... You'll pay for that. The fuck was that? 
God damn, that is... I did not expect to be seeing something. I don't know, that- this boss? What does it even remind me of? Like, it's so immense compared to everything else we fought, to the point that it's just kind of... I don't know. Like, it- And it also looks creepy as hell. Look at those teeth. Newcomers, let's welcome them. Watch the ones up above it too. respawns them? Okay. We're definitely going to have to come back to this, either as a bonus video or something. I don't know. I don't even know if this is part of the main story. Probably isn't. Level fucking 70, though. Jesus Christ. Um, God, what do I even say here? I guess I should pause the recording and just load back, because this is just going to be a waste of time here. So, yeah, <laughs> I'll meet you guys back when back from when the recording started, I guess, and we'll head to go do quests in Ganeth Haros. You know, I fear... Are we gonna have, like, f a boss for every element of this magnitude? Because that's insane, man. I did think that we were getting a lot of... Like, we've been facing a lot of, like, humanoid bosses and stuff like that, like... Like, uh... Balsif, Ganabelt, and whatnot. And it just definitely feels like, uh, it definitely feels like, in comparison, this is just, like, out of this world, almost, in comparison, you know? Like, I f like, also, this, this boss is, like, you know, wind, it's high up. Oh, shit. Uh, it's high up in the air. And then there was the other place that we saw in Menencia that was like a temple leading underground. So if that is a hinting at what we're going to have to deal with, then maybe there's going to be just like... I don't know. Maybe we'll have to deal with one that's underwater. Maybe we'll have to deal with one that's at sea or something. And then if there's one in Calaglia... I don't know where it would be in Calaglia, but obviously somewhere fire-related. I don't even know what you do for one made out of light, for like Cislodia, but I don't know. We'll get to that when we get to that. Now I'm finally gonna skip ahead. Okay, back. Now let's go and check out Ganetheros, because we have a shit ton back here. Hopefully they're not gonna take long, but yeah, we've got a lot of quests to accept. Hopefully, after this episode, or the episode after that, we will finally be done with side quests. That was quite the little adventure we went on. Because we have been having a lot to deal with. What do we got this time? No way. Nadio, is that you? You're finally home! Yo, pensive woman. Pensive emoji. All right. Forgive me, I do believe you have the wrong person. My name is Dohalim. As it so happens, I'm new to this area. <sighs> Oh, are you the ones who drove out those Zoogles? I'm so sorry, my mistake. Hmm. Fred not. It appears there's something troubling you, however. If it's not too much to ask, would you mind telling me a little about this naughty old fellow of yours? Hmm. I... I can't, I... Is it hard to discuss? As you can see, we're but a roving band of misfits. We've seen much of our tra... on our travels, so we don't shock easily. Hmm. Well, in that case... My name is Kag Kagari. N Natio is my lover, only he's a Renan. You don't say. I see. I can understand why you were hesitant, then. I take it something happened to him. Up until several months ago, we, m we used to meet in secret out, out of the village. But ever since then, he hasn't returned. <sighs> Sounded completely normal last time, though, so I don't know what's going on. Oh, Natio, whatever might have happened to you. Anyway, he works as a garden Pelagian. Wait. Pelagian? Have I been have I been mispronouncing it this whole time? I thought it was Pelagian. Unless that's a typo. I'm afraid he might have well Stay calm. There could be any number of reasons why he hasn't returned. At any rate, your story intrigues me. I feel personally invested now. We shall investigate this ourselves and get to the bottom of this. Huh? Really? You do that for me? Good. Gladly. Leave this matter to us. For now, we shall make our way to Pelagian. Okay, it was Pelagian. It was a typo, I guess. Any records we find there should tell us just where he went. Good idea. Mm. With that, we shall be on our way. 
With any luck, we should we should have good news before long. Sure. Yes, thank you. Missing lover. Oh, wait, that's a quest I actually needed. Okay. Uh, yeah, sure. Let's go accept the other ones while we're here, though. You shouldn't have gotten your hopes up. I felt moved by people whose love transcended the boundaries of race. I wanted to hope. I can see why you'd feel that way, I suppose. Your supple man, what you need? <clears throat> this is terrible. Our coastline is a wreck. Huh? What's wrong, sir? An enormous bird keeps whipping up these enormous twisters and ruining everything. That sounds like a zoogle to me. What a shame. It used to be so peaceful along here. Ridiculous. You should see all the flotsam and jetsam that's washed to, washed to, washed to shore. They say birds like shiny objects, don't they? Jet Sam, Jet Stream Sam. Mm. Memories broken, the truth goes unspoken. I guess flying zoogles must think. Like birds at any rate, we can't go fishing while those twisters are around. We're in deep trouble and now we'll see what we can do. Don't worry, sir, we'll blow those pesky tornadoes back to where they came right. from. If it's a bird's who go, we're dealing with that. We'll make it a nice and easy target for me to... Okay, sorry, I'll stop. Goodness, how do you two such brave young women? If you really intend to visit the short line, do be careful. Sorry, I I love Metal Gear Rising too much. I am a big fan of that series in general. Let's deal with all the other stuff around here first. To defeat the giant bird Zugal. Yeah, we'll do that. But first off, I want to head over here. Might as well get this last quest while we're here. While we are in town. Okay. <clears throat> oh. <clears throat> no, I need to come up with a new old man voice. <laughs> oh, you're the one who helped protect the village earlier. Would you mind letting me in here? Hey. Of course. Your people took good care of us during our stay. So, is something troubling you, sir? No, oh, no, it's nothing like that. I simply wondering, have you ever heard of the legendary fishing pole? Oh, God. Legendary fishing hole, you say? No, I haven't. Do tell more. I said pole, but okay. Well, there's a cave hidden in, in Shinefall Shine Woods, and inside there is a place that's supposed to be fish heaven. <laughs> I read about it in this here book I found. Whoa. It says you can catch a rare fish hardly found it anywhere else in the world. Great. Ooh. Not only are they rare, they're unbelievably delicious too. Oh. Ooh. Literally just caught all of the girls' attention. The f the the three key words: book, fish, and eat. <laughs> There's. <laughs> There's a master sword woman carrying meat. I don't have what it takes to venture inside of my age, but there were certainly lots of fish swimming around. It's enormous light. Oh god, light. Yeah, sounds like it. Yep, okay, this is where the water one is. Oh. Yes. Did you know and catch me one of those elusive okay. fish? I'll let you know how it tastes. <laughs> you won't need that book anymore, will you? If so, could I have it afterwards? Uh, sure, I guess that wouldn't be a problem. Great, let's get to work, ladies. Right. I was just looking for a way to work off that last meal. <laughs> uh, be careful with the light, too, okay? <laughs> Untamable rage. Okay, well, that's a, certainly a quest we're not going to be dealing with, because that is probably more frickin' level 60-plus stuff. The fish could be dwindling even as we speak. Oh, my fucking Time God. Time is of the essence. Let's hurry. I think you're making a mountain out of a molehill. I mean, I wouldn't expect anything less of either of them. For a second, I thought that was another quest, but that was just a person... That was just some lonely person that wanted to talk. 
Who has time for dialogue, am I right? Says the okay, person who constantly reads out 90% of dialogue in this game. It's not like I'm required to. Do I do it regardless? Yes. Do I need to? No. almost forgot about this area. Because we literally walked through here once and never looked back. Good old yawns. Never fail me. How strong is this thing? Are we talking like level 70 or something? No, actually this is, no, this is plausible. I can do this. Stormbringer. That's actually a pretty cool looking enemy design, not gonna lie. I'll deal with this, with this one. I'm godlike. Yo, know, check this. I'll smash you, says Law. Totally not a bit wacky or sussy to say. Hit him with this. And I'll stop your life. Hit him with the rotating. The rotating pile driver. Oh shit. Impact cross. I like that, it, that the weakness is on one of its wings. Penumbra. Um, let's go with this. Ow. Wow, really just going everywhere, aren't you? I like how we go from fighting one flying enemy to another in this episode. Whoa. Ow, you hit me with one of those stray things. Fuck you. Get on the ground. Oh, thank you. Appreciate that. There we go. Swallow dance. There we go. Yes, Hit him with all this. Oh god. Gomu Gomu no Gatoring! Out of here. Bop. Hit him. Hit him with that. Got him with that. Talon Hurricane. Here we go. Up oh, there we go. Finally lost the concentration. Here we go. Oh, 
Why'd you hear me? To stop you dying? Ah, oh, right. There we go. We're doing some good progress here. Wop. Finish him. Burn strike. Nice. Good to know my training is paying off. All right. Well, we're finally making some some headway on some stuff. Uh, yeah, right here. Fast travel back to town. Then we can turn this quest in. Then we can take the other quest. Oh. We've reached our destination. We got a good enough rhythm. We also have a quest to accept in the forest. Are those twisters finally gone? Are those twisters finally gone now? Yeah. Yep, they're all gone now. Those tornadoes were no match for me. How? Well, I'll be. Just what sort of magic did you use on those huh? things? Uh, actually, it was a team effort with Xion, right? Uh, yeah. I know how to fire a gun, so... So what were you doing when she, while she fired, young lady? Well... Well, I was cheering her on, giving her orders, and, um, giving her food. Hey! I'm not a dog, Rinwell. The point is, there are no more Zoogles for you to worry about. Anyway, see you later. <laughs> You're leaving already. You're a little twister yourself, young lady. Full of energy and gone in a flash. Green. Oh. Oh, she got an art for that. Gusty girl. Clever girl. Advanced one art that summons four tornadoes. Oh, shit, bro. Sheesh. You know what? Yeah, I'll get that. No reason not to. It's a strong art. We got two of them, in fact, for that. Uh, let's go Renwell. Damn, that's a, that's the first time we've gotten fire on her, actually, now that I think about it. Or at least I think that was fire, wasn't it? Yeah. It's just interesting to get fire on here after all this time. Turns on a flare tornado when charged. Interesting. Uh, where's the other one? Cyclone... Freeze Lancer. I still need... I don't have anything higher than Freeze Lancer still, but... We're working on it. Who... Alfin, you got something? Right, this. Now we have Elemental Attack plus, plus 40. We're doing pretty well on Alfin's stuff. We have a total of five of them maxed out now. AG Restore... Oh yeah, I can get that. I should probably check what I get from each of them before I decide. Kill prevention, ooh. Yeah, whatever. I plan, I'll, I'll probably get most of them, so it's not too big of a rush. Where's the quest? We got one over here. We've reached our destination. That we have. We got a quest down here. Oh, do you sense one of your friends, Hoodle? Oh, right. I forgot we have Hoodle around here. Oh. So I can go back here. Whoa. Whew, that was refreshing. You act like you just... Oh, whoops. So this is where. Seriously? Yikes! There's so many zoogles here. <laughs> I wonder if they contaminated the water. I sense a huge influx of astral energy deep inside the cave. It's probably coming from their leader. Oh shit! So this is where that quest is. I need to leave if I get the chance. It must be that light that's wreaked havoc on the fishing hole. Uh. Right. Who knows how many delicious fish we've lost out on because of it? Here we go. We're going in, Xion. No, we aren't. Calm down, you two. Whatever's down there is probably going to put up a tough fight. Good grief. 
I don't know. Once you make these two, those two mad, there's no Zoogle that can stop them. Okay, don't... Okay, game's not forcing me in. Okay. Holy shit. I don't even know if I want to know what's in here. I love the colors, though. This is extremely fucking Remind pretty. Again why we're all getting soaking wet just to find some fishing hole? Listen, this is pretty as hell. Some things are better left unquestioned. But what? Oh my god. Something wrong? No, not at all. Gee, I wonder where that fishing hole could be. Lot, at least you're learning. You are learning not to question the likes of them. Okay. I'm not going to go far, but I just want to test this. How 43 not actually too bad. Okay, so I can actually face these things. I don't have to worry about, like, immense... Taking immense damage from these things. And I can actually fight them. Here we go. I'm glad that these enemies aren't, like, 50 levels higher than me, and I can actually face them. They're still, like, a lot of levels higher than me, but they're not, like, an incredible amount to the point where it just feels BS, you know? Impact Cross. One-hit wonder. Can achievement. Such harmony. Takes a singular will. Ah, uh, shoot. Well, the game's letting me do s some of this stuff, so I'm gonna. Yeah, let's see if we can go around here, perhaps, and see if I can't get to that chest over there. And also, maybe I can, you know, get stuff like this. Uh, I don't know if I can even get past them, but... Oh, I could. Cool. Makes things easier for me. For me. Revival ring. This might be some decent equipment. Anything that makes battles easier is okay by me. Alright. Okay, I'm huh? not gonna... I think we're done here, because I don't want to go deep into this place. We'll come back here later. But for now, I think we're fine. I've just got to keep a note that that place is there for later. Finally. If only we could have flown with the wind to get here faster. Okay, now let's let's talk to this shirtless dude. Yeah. Hey there, beautiful. Can I ask you a favor? Mm -hmm. What do you need? No, I don't mean you, Burly. I'm talking about the other pretty lady over there. Shut. Wow. Fucking rude, dude. Who, me? I must say, you've got to be pretty strong to make it all the way here. That's why I think you're the perfect one to ask. Sure. Just get to the point already, will you? Well, you see, I'm trying to make my way back home to Thistlem, but there's this giant bee buzzing around. My guess is it's a queen bee. Ain't nothing else it could be as far as I can see. <laughs> anyway, I'm too scared to try and walk past it, so I'm stuck here. <laughs> and just what has anything of this got to do with me? Hmm. Judging from the calluses on your finger, I take it you're a gunslinger, yeah. <laughs> I was a fighter in my younger years, so I can tell these things. Anyway, I was hoping you could shoot down that bee for me. If you were a fighter, what's stopping you from just taking care of it yourself? I hate to admit it, but I'm purely a ground fighter. I'm hopeless against anything that flies around. I'm worried if that queen hangs around for long, she'll spawn even more bees, and then I'll really have no hope of, hope of getting home. <laughs> <sighs> the last thing we need is more bugs crawling around. All right, you win. I'll see if I can get rid of it. <laughs> I knew it was right to ask you. My buddy ain't what it used to be, but I still got a good eye for these th things in more ways than one. <laughs> Freaking gross ass. Uh, fine. We'll take care of your stupid thing. Do you sense one of your friends, Hoodle? I'm still trying to figure out where the hell this thing How is. How did it come to this? You're a beautiful woman, Shion. That's a good thing, right? Wait, Kisara. Hey, Kisara. Oh. Uh, How did it come to this? You said the same line twice, but also, yeah, that dude was just rude. 
Isara didn't deserve that. Isara is extremely pretty as well. They both are. Judging by the stench, I'd say the animals at the ranch are all grown now. Alright, I didn't need to deal with that. Uh, manage ranch. The pig meat. Got a bunch of that. Uh, yeah. I'm, I think the game wanted me to, like, deal with the one of each, so... I, I think I've done most of these, but I guess I'll do one of each and we'll just leave it. Okay, now let's go find and beat the shit out of this giant-ass bee. If there's one thing... I don't like that guy, but I will say, if there is one thing I like beating the, the shit out of, it's insects. I freaking hate those things. Like, almost all of them. There's only a few that I don't dislike. Which are, like, uh... Butterflies, okay, and, like... Yeah, butterflies and dragonflies, sure probably. Wanna bet? Now nah, we can take this. We're in for a long slog with this one. That we are. Can you take us? Violation! These things really get on my nerves. You know what? You don't see me. I'm just chilling over here. Let a marksman handle it. All yours. Take this. Tempest. Out of here. Out of here. Here we go. Well, I missed that. Low key. Ashes to ashes. There's still more to go. I'll smash you! Reload! Rotating pile driver. Here I come! Tornado drive! Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good damage. Good damage. Good damage. Out of here. There we go. It's okay. Oh wait. Oh, are, they, are these enemies infinitely respawning? Was that dude trying to give me a hint earlier? He probably was. If so, that probably means I've just got to focus on, on the boss and just do a constant... Yeah. Come on. Here we go. Oh shoot. Yo, hit him with the flare demolisher. Hit him with that dollar store shield. The reason I say dollar store is because it does not hit for too much. At least not as much as you would expect. Out of here. Out of here. Out of here. I'm only getting turned on. My natural defenses are fading. I'm a sitting duck. Retreat from Sounds like a, a problem for you. Man, it's been a holy shit. God. He sat he he looks so cool with rod extension on some moves. There we go. Obelisk blade. Here's a healing arc. This one's mine. Now you see what I can do. Here we go. Lunar arc. Penumbra. Hurricane flight. Watch yourself. Oh shit. 
Oh shit. Did, yo, he just used the, his frick. Did that bee just use its babies as like frickin' explosives? Oh my god, they did. Okay. Uh, shit. All right. There we go. Yeah, you know what? Do that. I'm gonna get law in. There we go. Okay. Let me just switch to law. Uh oh. Out of here. Get on the floor. Everybody do the dinosaur. Ariel. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh god. Oh no, not this again, not this again, not this again. I hate this move so much. Ooh. Oh god damn. Okay, just do that. I believe. I believe. Okay, everyone's alive. This is what matters. Okay. Out of here. Look sharp. Slash him. Melt to a crisp. Ah, oh, that thing's finally dead. Okay. Nice one, Alfin. Yeah, there's more where that came from. Report back to the client. Sure thing. Then I guess we can see if we have any new conversations. Probably here? not, but who knows. Where the frick is this thing? I still am trying to figure out where this damn quest is. Is it is it just me or were you even more ruthless than usual out there today? Sure. There's no law saying I have to be nice to bugs. Yo, yo, based? Although I'll admit, part of it is just because I know I have you there to protect me. Shion. Well, if it ain't my favorite femme fatale, I was watching you fight that queen bee from the sidelines out there. You're as beautiful as bed roses when you fight. Why, I think we have a new queen on our hands if you get what I'm saying. <laughs> this here's actually my bathing spot. It'd be an honor to take a dip with you, my queen. <laughs> What you say? <laughs> Trying to make him sound as nerdy and as unappealing as possible. I'll pass. I don't like men who only care about looks. The bee's dead. Now go home before I regret killing it. Holy <laughs> shit. Woof, with a glare like that, it would stand a chance. Hope I catch a pretty face to get a fish lip sometime. <laughs> Bitch. Just great. Ugh, that guy turns my stomach. I know, right? I'm exhausted. Let's find a place to rest. Well, Sounds good to me. Inspect... Insect... Dep dis deposer? Sorry, I'm just... It just caught me off guard. Well, I'll go get both of those. Defense plus 40... Yeah, we'll f we'll we'll work on all of that, I guess. Yeah, this will work. And then we'll go and try to. Oh, I'm really tired. I'm really tired today for some reason. Oh, this is voice acting. Anyway, I should get to work on dinner. Oh, we already started. We've got it covered tonight, Kisara. Just relax and leave it to us. Oh, I see. 
Well, I'll leave it to you then. We don't have a lot of ingredients though, so don't go overboard, okay? Guess I'll do some laundry instead. Oh, let me guess, the guys are gonna have it covered or something? Hmm? What are you two doing? <laughs> what does it look like? We're doing laundry, obviously. Yeah, I guess you are. You're not trying to clean them by smacking them around again, are you? Of course not. I have a good memory. Once someone yells at me, I don't forget it. <laughs> He's fine, Kisara. I've been keeping an eye on him, and there haven't been any problems. Oh, good. If you say so, Alvin, then I have nothing to worry about. Hey, how come you don't trust me when I say it? <laughs> God. Just don't squeeze too hard or else you'll damage the fabric. Okay? Let me ask, is she gonna have, like, one last thing she tries to do, but then Dohalim's already taking care of it? Yeah, I get it. You know, if you keep making that face, it's gonna stick that way. What was that? Oh, shit. Uh, nothing. <laughs> nothing at all. <laughs> well, if there's nothing for me to do, I guess I'll head back. Oh. I suppose I should take this as a sign of how much they've all grown, but... Ah. Uh. Oh, Dohalim. What are you doing here? Well, I was right on him being the last one, at least. Simply admiring our campfire as I await dinner. I find watching the flames dance can be rather inspiring. <laughs> Just the same as always, then. Although I'm sort of relieved. Oh? And here I thought you were planning to scold me. Why? Did you want to be scolded, too? <laughs> what? No, I wasn't saying that. <laughs> this way of reacting. Hmm. The night is aglow. With star and firelight. Another poem? Yet what I hold most dear are the words of a friend. That's not like your usual poetry. Are you trying to tell me something? Brimming is thy soul with words yet unspoken. <laughs> okay, I get it. You want me to talk to you about it. To hear your words of worry, I can but sit and wait. <laughs> <laughs> I said I get it. I like it. I like it. <laughs> Tolium's a freaking funny dude. I guess I'm just struggling with how capable everyone's become these days. I'm proud of them, but I'm not sure what I contribute to the team anymore. So, I guess it's been troubling me a bit. Oh. Hmm. They don't need me for chores or fighting anymore, and I don't have much in the way of feminine charm. But aside from being a soldier, do I have anything else to offer? And if not, then what good am I? I can't help worrying about it. Everyone always has doubts at some point or another. Hmm. Lost though you may be, with utopia but a dream, life without you would be no life at all. Aww. <sighs> Dohalim. What a nice dude. You're right. I still have Nagal's dream left to fulfill, and we still have the fight ahead of us to overcome. With you by my side, even the bitter times can taste sweet. Okay, I think that's enough poetry for one day. Oh, she's blushing. Oh, that's so sweet. Aww. Hey, dinner's ready. Wow, that is adorable. Wow, you look really happy, Kisara. Uh, oh, I'm just excited to see what you two have cooked up. Damn. Now let's sit down and enjoy it already. Wow, they really had, they really paired up every party member in this game. You know what? I'm, I'm with it. You've got the you've got the main character couple. You've got you've got Law and Rinwell, and now apparently apparently Dohalim and Kisara. That was, I thought I thought those two were not gonna were not gonna end up having any you know shipping material, and they were just gonna be just kind of like you know, or close. But no, apparently not. With that scene, her place. Damn, SP and gold, and a lot of each. Dohalim, all of your replies last night were poems. What was that all about? Hmm. I suppose I was struck with poetic inspiration. Did it strike your fancy? Yes. I found it to be quite elegant. <laughs> I'm afraid my memory of them is a bit faint. Could I trouble you to recite them for me? Uh. No, you cannot. Remember them yourself. Aww. <laughs> uh. Yeah, let's get that, then I'll get this next. Let's see if there's anything I can get with anyone. This. Artifacts aqu types acquired. Rilled Repig. 
Right, I still need to find that out. We'll have to do that next time. Penetration, hee <laughs> hee. Well, extension crit rate, yeah, sure. Then we'll aim for that next. Kisara. Attack plus 20, att attack plus 50, sheesh. I'll get that, I guess, and then strength and counter edge. Then I can focus that one next. Yeah, I, th I think we're doing fine here. Faster AG recovery. Yeah, I'll save up for that one. And then let's let's get some rest. Do we have grilled root pig? Is that a thing we have? Grilled root pig, grilled root pig, grilled root pig. Maybe not. Well, I can get this one at least. Huh. I must admit, I'm rather proud of this dish. Fancy. Oh shit. I guess I can't talk to Law. Hmm. Okay. Don't blame Don't then. Care if I hang out for a while? Another fine day for journeying, huh? Tell me, do you ever find yourself tiring of the vagabond existence? It's better than being enslaved, that's for sure. I get to pick my own destination, for starters. <laughs> yeah. You don't get those luxuries as a slave. Shackle a man's feet, and you put a clamp on his heart as well. Then there was the food. Gross slop that left you in a permanent state of hunger. Ugh, you wouldn't believe the things I ate to keep from starving. Yes. What about you? This must all sound pretty alien to someone who used to be a lord. Is that a hint of interest in my past I detect? <laughs> I guess that's one way to put it. Well, certainly starvation was never a concern I had to contend with. The day-to-day -day grind was largely taken care of for me. I even had help getting in and out of clothes. All that was required of me was standing still while looking solemn. That's quite the downgrade you've made. It's a wonder you don't sound more bitter. This might surprise you, but I actually don't find our current situation all that disagreeable. Mm. My own hardships paled in comparison to yours, granted. But life as a lord came laden with its own restrictions. Yeah, it's not the same type, but it's <laughs> probably... Me. Such complaints must sound like feeble extravagances to a Danon. True, Ren and Opulence doesn't feature high on my sympathy list. And again, yours isn't exactly a normal case. I suppose it's not. Sometimes, I can't help but wonder how much easier life would have been without the trappings of nobility. You really mean that? Pay me no heed. Not but the ramblings of a privileged eccentric. Mm. Whatever my past, it has led to my being here. That is all the reality I need concern myself with. It's kind of funny, on exact opposite ends of the field, you still feel, like, I don't know, slaves are, like, considered to be, like, you know, bottom of the bottom, and nobility is, like, top of the top, and yet both, it, both feel like they're shackled in a way. I mean, slaves are more obviously shackled, but nobility, you're, like, you're, like, constricted by customs, by by expectations, by what you're required to do, you know? It's an, obviously it's not as tax it's not as physically taxing. And probably not as mentally either, but it's still like to a lesser extent, at least emotionally taxing, maybe. I suppose we should call it a day. You know? I don't know. That's just my that's just my way of thinking on it. I wouldn't I wouldn't personally know either way, but once we finish eating, we should get going. I guess we'll finish eating next time then on Tales of Arise. The only thing left we have to do is that one is finishing that one quest in Pelegion, and then we can finally head to the wharf and 
potentially continue plot. There is a, a one more quest there, however. That, hmm, that might just be the quest for Mahogs. No, wait, no, we got the quest for Mahogs. The, hmm, I don't know. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. But yeah, next time on Tales of Arise, we'll take care of the finishing touches, and then we'll finally continue plot. Adios, ciao, and bye-bye. Signing off until next time. Ja matane.